Hey, what's up? I'm Grant. I'm one of the instructors here at Deliberate Dynamics. Today, I'm going to give you a real quick smoke check on Arcteric's new Assault 45 pack. Uh, like most of their packs, this thing just opens up with a big clamshell to get you into the main pouch, and that's where we'll start. Got to unclasp these little buckles on the outside, and we'll just open that thing all the way up. As we get into the nuts and bolts of this, you can see on this left side a nice padded pouch with a couple of external little pouches as well. Velcro all on the inside of those. This also pops right off as well, man. Pretty bitchin'. On the other side, little Velcro pouch again. Two little zipper pouches meshed. Same thing, Velcro's right off. On the inside, I'll take off these three pouches. Let me push pause for a second. If you do end up buying one of these from Deliberate Dynamics, you get to choose uh, two of these pouches. We've got these window pouches and these smaller pouches right here. And I just put these things right in the center. You saw how I was rocking them. But what I want to point out here are these little ribs right here, these little ribs that open right up. You can actually see these aluminum internals. You can take those aluminum internals and articulate them to fit the small of your back and just fit, you know, just fit your body to make sure you're comfortable. So you've got that option to work with as well. Continuing on through here, if you're going to run a bladder or maybe you're going to run some sort of comm system and you have to plumb your pack with uh, uh, you know, your water tubes or antennas or any type of cords, on the left side and the right side, we've got those pockets for you. Up high in that top corner is where your plumbing can come through and you can feed all of the stuff that you need to be plumbing properly. Uh, again, on both sides of these, daisy chains all the way down so you can hook carabiners in there, maybe some 550 cord. Uh, also, as we're looking at this, we've got good carrying straps on both the left and the right side. Zipping this thing back up. Come back up to the top here. The old pack used to have that internal pocket. They got rid of it this, this go because uh, it seemed like it was a, I don't want to call it a design flaw, but it seemed like it would just weight all of that stuff and it, some of it would drop down into the pack. So they've negated it this go around, but they've still given you that top little uh, uh, pouch right there uh, with, again, some more daisy chain and some more places for you to secure your gear to. As far as the straps themselves, this go around, they've actually doubled down on the padding on the inside. They've got daisy chains going all the way down, even little spots for you to hook up your, your bladders, uh, your actual uh, mouthpiece uh, to your bladder. Uh, as far as your waist strap, that waist strap is removable, which is kind of cool, uh, but it's also adjustable if you want that working uh, uh, for you as well. They're calling these uh, pods, kind of where all the buckles and all the systems and all the loosey-goosey stuff is going to take place. But again, everything here is adjustable and can be fitted uh, for you to articulate to fit your person, uh, whether you have gear on or whether you have gear off. That's the cool thing about this assault pack is it will work with all of your issued PPE, helmet, body armor, kit, all of that stuff. But a pretty legit little pack from Arcteryx, the Arcteryx 45, and uh, yeah, we're digging it over here. Actually, this one's going home with me, perfect size.